What's up guys, in this video I will show you how to stop receiving WhatsApp messages on your Android device without necessarily turning off your data or internet connection. Now there are a couple of reasons why you might want to do this. So take for instance, if WhatsApp consumes so much of your internet data, then it is actually wise that you turn it off so that it does not consume your data. It might also be necessary for you to turn off your WhatsApp messages when you're using your internet connection for something else and you don't want the distraction that comes from WhatsApp messages and notifications. In this video, I will show you how to disable or turn off WhatsApp whenever your internet connection is turned on. Okay, so here is my Android device and there are actually a couple of ways you can stop receiving WhatsApp messages when your data is turned on. But the most common one which i believe will work for everybody is simply to go to your settings application now once you get to the settings you want to scroll down from the top to where you find apps so you want to actually find apps on your settings click on it and then you want to go to app management now in this place you're going to find all of the applications on your android device including the system applications so you want to scroll down until you find whatsapp or you can just search for whatsapp on the search bar over here now click on it now you want to go down until you find the fourth stop option now in my case it is actually one of the bottom tabs over here so what you just want to do is to click on it and click on ok now to explain what the first stop option actually is it enables you to stop running an application both on the background or in any mode until that application is opened again and you don't have to worry about the security issues or whether it will actually affect your phone basically what this does is to stop the application from running on the background and as such whatsapp will no longer receive data connection until you open the application again in addition to that this does not actually make your whatsapp misbehave because it is not a system application on your device so once you have first stopped the whatsapp application you can now go back to your device and turn on your data connection once you turn on your data connection you will find out that whatsapp will no longer receive any notification or messages on your device again until you open the device now once you open the device whatsapp will start to receive messages and for you to also stop the notification and messages from coming to your device again you just want to go back to the settings application and for stop the whatsapp application again and you will be good to go i hope this video was helpful guys if it was please make sure you smash that like button and subscribe to this youtube channel for more interesting tech tips like this one